three. The bin is now up. Finally. Now we're able to get to work on it. I buried 135 feet of drain tile all around the circumference of the building and over the edge of a little drop off. I had a lot of people asking me about how the silo was attached to the concrete wall. And these are the brackets that I chose. Those are one inch lags into the cement. Had a went up to about eight feet tall um, wall poured around the bin for backfill of the house retaining wall. Then I'm able to start on the floors. I'm all into thermal storage and I wanted to dig down and replace it with sand and just put lots of foam board insulation on the floor, the sides, even around the columns because I didn't want anything to heat sink the cement. So actually the cement pad that we poured is over six inches thick and it's actually floating with foam insulation on all sides. Yeah, I put a layer of plastic underneath the foam on top of the two layers of foam and then a hog fencing or a cheap fencing on top hold everything in place which in turn I put 300 feet of PEX tubing down so it was all securely fastened and wouldn't float as we poured the floor.